So once my model in Revit is set up and ready, uh, I can export it to Nav Navisworks so, uh, and uh, add-ins, go to Navisworks 2017. Um, and we want to save it as an NWC file. So choose your directory, uh, name it, click on Navisworks settings. And you guys should have that setup which is displayed in front of you now. So make sure all these boxes are ticked. Uh, yeah, just copy these settings. Once we are ready, click save. It will take some time to load and so uh, now we open Navisworks we can append the ex the model that we just created so go look for it um, where you we saved it and it was an NWC file click open guys can now see this is the model that we had in Revit. Next, we would like to associate a timeline with the model. So from Timeliner, CSV import, and we look for the schedule that we saved in CSV format so click open now you gotta map these fields to your schedule so um, so the task name we had task ID in our schedule or title title of task for every task name display ID is the task ID uh, plan start date well actually Let's stick with actual start date and actual finish. Um, we can set these to start and finish in our in our schedule, but I'll, I'll remove it for now. Um, and then map also your task ID in, onto another field just in case. You gotta specify a synchronization ID as well, so that will be our task ID. Um, once that is ready. Highlight it and click on all and select the data source rebuilt task hierarchy. You can see now the schedule has been important. 